Hi everyone, today I'm going to share my thoughts on when I think we should rely on intuitions and gut instincts and when I think we shouldn't and I'll share some questions that you can use in everyday SE with friends and family to get a sense of how they know that relying on intuition or gut instinct is a reliable way to know what's true. If you don't know what SE is, then check out this video first, what is street epistemology, and then come back to this one. One theory is that intuitions and gut instincts are often the result of our unconscious mind processing and evaluating information that our conscious mind may not be aware of. There have been some studies that have looked at the role of intuition and gut instincts in decision making and problem solving, but the results have been mixed. There is no consensus amongst experts about the reliability of intuition or gut instincts as a way to know what's true. Some experts believe that these feelings can be useful in certain situations, such as when we need to make a quick decision or when we have a lot of experience or expertise in a certain area, especially when combined with other forms of evidence and when used in conjunction with critical thinking skills. Others believe, however, that relying too heavily on intuition or gut instincts can lead to errors or biased judgments. That's because our intuitions and gut instincts can sometimes be influenced by other related beliefs or by biases or past experiences that may not be relevant or accurate in the present situation. If you haven't already seen them, check out my videos on filtering errors, interpretation errors, and motivated reasoning. I'll put the links in the description below. So when should we have confidence in a belief based on intuition or gut instinct? I think it's helpful first to consider the source of the intuition or instinct. If it comes from a place of expertise or a lot of experience, then it may be more reliable, but still not necessarily so. It's something I would rely solely on only if I was forced to make a quick decision without the opportunity to test it using the four operational criteria that guide when I think I should be confident about it. Predictive accuracy and precision, explanatory efficiency, optimal flexibility, and rational coherence. Again, if you haven't seen my video on that, I'll put the link to that video in the description below as well. If someone claims to have confidence in a belief because of their intuition or gut instinct, here are some questions that can be asked to casually explore if in that situation, that is a reliable way to be confident about what's true. And remember, rapport and consent are always prioritized over everything else when doing SE. And I would usually only ask one to three of these questions in everyday casual SE situations. So be aware of that. One, has your intuition or gut instinct always been a reliable way to work out what's true for you? Two, if your intuition or gut instinct wasn't a reliable way to know what's true in that situation, how can we tell if it is a reliable way to know what's true with this belief? Three, I wonder what experts have to say about when we should rely on intuition or gut instinct and when we shouldn't. Who would be good experts to discover that from? How could we find that out? Okay, I hope this video was helpful. If you want to see more like this and haven't already done so, please hit the subscribe and notification buttons below. Take care and thanks for watching.